I'm just gonna get my team together before I actually save. And we're also gonna see if I can actually take on this boss. Cause well, I'm, I'm 68. The boss was giving me trouble before. This boss actually always gives me trouble when I get to this point in the game. Cause it's honestly really tough. Yes, Fuka, we will be very careful. Alright. Now, I'm gonna return, take on some bosses. I know I've said this a couple times already, but these are the Fierce Cyclops. Fierce Cyclops have 1700 HP. These resist slash and strike and fire and are null electric as well as light and dark. Uh, they use mostly physical attacks, so it's interesting dealing with them. Leave it to me. I never get. Did I not give Mitsuru? And Korra their um, rings? I don't know if I did or not. I don't remember giving them the vitality rings. It looks like they have them, but I don't I remember buying them and don't but don't remember giving it to them. That's never good. I'm actually gonna drop an attack mirror. Yukari will probably bring back Mitsuru. What do I have on? This is no Pierce one. This is no Slash one. I feel like I should be on this Persona, but I don't feel like I can output damage as well. about this so I'm gonna do that to myself. That's a power charge. That's never good. That's two power charges. That's three power charges. This is awful. Drop the attack mirror because this is kind of bad. Hang in there. All right, good, good, good. Our entire my entire team is max HP. I got hit. Okay, that's good though. It's 
I'm gonna keep using mirrored arrows because it's the only real offensive thing that I have. At least I don't take quite I don't take quite as much damage. I think that was all of our um, attack mirrors. So I'm gonna put another one down real quick. Drop another attack mirror. And this power charge one. Okay. Always good. I actually like that Mitsuru's healing people first because this way Yukari is using Megaridine more frequently. And Yukari's got a better chance at actually dealing damage to me. Get off a mirrored arrows. Okay, cars get jacked up a little bit. I figured I figured Mitsuru would be going next to the DR Han. The cars probably gonna top me off in her time. Oh McGarrett. McGarrett, I'm not I'm okay with that. I think I should throw now another attack mirror just in case. I don't know who's dropped and who's didn't. Okay, my name is Sirius didn't drop. I wasn't sure. So that's at least two attacks we're not experiencing this turn, which is good. So we're actually getting to a a strange point in this boss fight where if something happens it can actually be potentially really weird what happens that's literally the best I can explain it it's potentially really weird what might happen The cars my guard on might kill one of them. It did, nice. And last resort. Last resort, this is this could be really good or really bad. Last resort has Okay. Nor near as awful as I thought. They have Mazionga? Um I'm gonna be completely honest, I'm just gonna bead myself and make sure I'm at full HP in case stupid shit happens. He might just last resort because his HP is really low. And that's just what the AI is programmed to do. Low HP, last resort. And we're all gonna be topped off, which makes it even more awesome. Damage slash attack for the kill. Okay. And with that, we have hit rank number eight, I believe, of the Judgment Arcana. Very nice. You're yeah. That's the case. Let's go this way. And we got a Soma. Always nice to get those. Always nice. So I'll see you guys in a moment or two after I save and come back up this come back up to continue exploring Tartarus.
And I just want to keep this in mind. We have one floor boss remaining to take care of. Only one. <coughs> this could be really frightening, but we've come so far, we can't be stopped now. On running. I realized that I could probably fight these enemies and get very easy experience, but as I've said in the past, I'm just not trying to waste a lot of time grinding levels on screen, because I feel like that's just not entertaining to watch. Hey, stuck case. Someone say box. Well, oh. Alright, we'll just kill this guy real quick. Be careful. Give me a sec. I'll scan the target. Okay, they block and pierce. I think these things block on all physical. They're weak to strike. They're doing some massive damage, I'm not gonna lie. That was pretty funny, I'm not even gonna lie. Just no more Maragi down, I don't see the point of hitting over there with me. Experience. Not too bad. Not too bad. Unfortunately, I was only a thousand experience, and you, s and I have shown off the large amount of experience that can be gained at this stage of the game. Did I just fight these guys? That's unfortunate. Fire isn't working. Oh, the car is enraged. Oh shit, Cora. This thing must have like a stupid eye evasion or something. I had a nice struggle experience and a level up, nice. Sit at level 69.
Okay. Oh, wait. Wait. Duh. The 252nd floor. Alright. We've gone through a lot of floors of Tartarus, I must say. And to think, we're just a few fl a few floors away from beating the final Tartarus floor boss. It's a really weird thing to think about. Damn, man, I ran myself into a dead end. Hate it when that happens. Wow. One wrong turn. I had three floors away. Okay, no staircase in this direction. Good to know. Oh, nice. We're here. And next floor, we have the enemy. Yep, good idea. Watch out! They're books. Maybe books catch on fire. Wow. I have no idea why that worked. The wand, the ten, the level ten wand. Whatever, that's fine because we are at the final floor boss of the game. So I'll see you guys in a moment after I go save and heal up. Just fixed up some equipment, and now it's time to take on the final floor boss of the game. The Hanged Man. That's this Guardian's Arcana. All right, this is the Jousting of Grief. The Jousting of Grief has 4,000 HP, and it drains everything except for Pierce, an almighty attack. This boss is built specifically to take down unprepared parties and nothing else. So. What I'm gonna do is put Yukari on full assault, Mitsuru on heal support, Koromaru on heal support. 
Reasoning because Yasuo and Koro can't damage this while me and Yukari can. The Jasmine Grief has magic and physical attacks as well as stat debuffing attacks. Let's see how our rain does in terms of damage. This is this a crit? Ooh, we got a crit in there. That's actually really nice. Yeah, I'm probably gonna be spamming arrow rains for this fight. Oh, that's an early Megiddo Leon. That's scary. Okay. Try going to heal support. Leave it to me. I'm just gonna have faith that I'm gonna get healed. Oh my god, broken. I'm just, I switched the card to heal support for this turn, just so that she can her and Mitsuru together can top off most of the party. Although you probably think one break is a better idea. I'm just gonna use a beat on myself just because I don't trust anything. Shit, it's not very good. But luckily, people on heels. Oh, that's not good. People on heels support at least. They're still fine. Okay, I'm just raged. That's good. I'll be honest. Having everyone in heal support is probably my best way to get through this. It doesn't even take half of the serious HP anymore. My next time I'm going to take you card off heal support and put it on full assault again. Leave it to me. And all the pain. Kari, no, you idiot! Oh, wait. What? She wouldn't broke him. Kari used the Arahan on me. Oh, that's right, she's on full assault. At this point, I actually can't, cannot survive a Mega Idolion, so let's use a beat. And I'll be honest, that stagnant air is going to be really scary. I 
Another crit. Nice. Okay, that's fine. Choose arrow in again. Wow, they both whiffed in Fury. This could be bad. That hit three. That's kind of awful. <sighs> That's actually really bad. Oh shit. That was really lucky, because that could have been so awful. That could have been really bad. That was really lucky. And, as a reward for defeating him, we have hit rank nine of the Judgment Arcana. All right, I really don't like the spear at all. So, but you know, what, honestly, this is a, this is a solid weapon. I think I'm just gonna keep this on because Nyonir only did um what's it called damage? Oh like damage and I wanna so I want some source of physical damage from my main protag at all times. That doesn't cost me HP. There, we're only a few floors away from the top of the tower. I can just feel it. And with this, we have reached the, not only have we reached the top of Tartarus, but we have maxed out the Judgment Arcana. Now, we just nearly, merely need to bide our time until the promised day, that being January 31st. With 20 days remaining. We can now create Messiah the Savior. Uh, Messiah is one of the most broken personas in this game. It's, it's more than a little bit on the OP side. That we've done everything we can do in Tartarus. But you know what? Um, I'm going to end this recording session here with us reaching the top of Tartarus. Off camera, I'm going to grind levels and just grind as much as I can in Tartarus before everyone gets tired. So I will see you guys next episode with my hopefully higher level team. Peace, peace, and deuce, deuce. See ya!